how to speak, presentation, body language. Because for a model, it's very important when they first time, when they never face the audience, they not even hold the mic in their hand. They're very nervous. So not just how you speak, how you give eye contact to the crowd, how you respect the judges. So you read all this is totally put into a package, and we train them how to do. It. Because sometimes in the audience there might be some comment, somebody might pass something. We should not be distracted. And whenever you're doing an event, as you know, there a lot of just before the event there might be something that goes wrong. What should not affect is it should not affect your performance. So it should not affect your performance. So that's very important. A performance is there the lifestyle because what have they? They have studied. They have worked hard for maybe four, five days, or maybe after the audition they had four, five months gap. After four, five months they have to come and perform. So that half an hour and one hour should be the best. So we teach them. We even teach them on question answers because there are a lot of question answers. And how to answer? What are the question? How to understand the question? Because sometimes when a judge asks a question, it could be very funny or it could be very odd. A question could even come if you meet a blind man and you have to explain him the color blue. How would you do it? So person when when gets a question like this, he doesn't know what to answer. He's a zap. So we tell him how to handle that. So that's basically how we train them. And of course, Zen Asia Foundation. I'm associated with them. I think for more than 15 to 20 years. And I have done more than 95 beauty pageants. For Miss Mumbai, Miss Maharashtra, Miss Earth, uh, Fashion Star, and many other. So basically, is how to make them comfortable on stage. So that's my job. See, first of all, when I'm a judge, where am I a judge? Now, if I'm a judge in a very professional show where the models are the top in the world, or the top. Uh, You know, models then by judging become different. Now the contestants here are newcomers, so I have to be a little lenient to them. But I can't have the same rules for them and the other one. So, as I said in Hindi, as I said, I'm a puri, right? So we keep on changing now because it's the first time. We give them some grace, but on these we select which is the best. Not just in how to speak, presentation, what dress they wore, how they carry it. That's very important. When you're a model, you don't come for a wedding interview. You're a model. So you have to behave like a model. That's what we teach them: how they give eye contact, the body language, how you actually flirt with the crowd. Basically, a model needs to flirt with the crowd. If they don't flirt with the crowd, it doesn't work. I I think this message I don't need to give to the models. I need to give to the parents because our parents are a little backwards. They don't want their models to go. They don't. They feel the modeling line is very bad. Uh, it's not that there are some people which are bad, but that happens in every industry. It's not necessarily only in this industry. It could be the airline, it could be a job. So what they should work on this is encourage the children, let them go out because when they get trained in a beauty pageant, it's not only for the beauty pageant, it's for the life. Imagine when they can come and talk on the mic. It's not only in the beauty pageant. They can talk for an interview. They can talk for an interview. They can do a seminar. They can handle a crowd. So the training which they get is the best. This is something which is extraordinary. So I, I encourage all the parents to en encourage the children to get into the field. Even if they don't make it top, nothing wrong. They learn something and go. What is the problem? When you get something, is fantastic.